Hello boys and girls. Welcome to Peak Killer Machine in Wasteland 2. We've made a little stop on our way to uh, back to whatever the west side is called. And now with some great skill and skates coming we have opened up a way to this cache. <laughs> Yay! Toilet paper. We shall leave this stuff here and take the useful stuff. So at the moment the canyon is all intact. Oh wait, guys, 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 guys. Oasis. Yes. So, to our knowledge, we are on our way to the citadel, but I already know. Citadel is calling Ranger Team Echo. Please respond. Yes. 10 4 Echo 1, good to hear your voice. Now listen, a situation occurred while you were off the air. The Red Scorpion militia has gotten a bee in their bonnet about something, and they've been sending squads into our territory to harass our people and sabotage our work. Danforth is calling it retribution for ranger <laughs> atrocity, but I got no idea what he's talking about. Whatever it is, it's got to stop. Copy? Copy. 10 4. Unfortunately, all other teams are currently out trying to chase down these damn hit squads, so you're on your own. I need you to get to the prison and see what the hell is up down for us at. And if you can get him to calm down or make peace, then do what you have to do. Disrupt his operations, destroy his base, kill him, capture him. I don't care what it is, just get the little pest off our back. We're not going to be able to send you to L.A. unless this mess is dealt with. You read me? Mm -hmm. Get four, Echo One, and get moving. Citadel base out. Okay. Quite finished. Okay, save here. So basically, I have a hunch. My hunches have been wrong before, but 
I have a hunch that this whole thing has to do with this shit. Which means so there might be some uh, relevant info at High Pool. At some of those graves that we couldn't dig up because people would get angry when we did that. So everything that this dude has been saying seems to stem from some idea that uh, rangers kill kids like on a regular basis okay hero of high pool engineer's note and we have brought this with us just for this purpose I don't know if it's gonna be any help but uh, I don't know context and shit So I keep thinking about uh, Wasteland 1 uh, quite early on in the game. Yeah, I think it's it's also in High Pool. So there was the situation in High Pool. I think uh, like there there was a guy, there was a little boy, and there was a dog. I don't remember what exactly happened, but it was a difficult situation. Oh. What's that? Uh oh. Uh, if that's Marco, then that's Claudia. Or whatever her her name was. like the prison won't be the resort spot it used to be okay these guys are still still dead There's a way to prevent this. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm gonna try something. So our our last uh, good save. 
What's here? Yes. to the oasis first. So, so far we have been postponing the prison because the... Oh, traveling vendor. We've been postponing it because uh, the robot at the gates doesn't seem to respond. But maybe it just needed some time to, I don't know, get going. Hello! Ah, that's the one who say sells uh, ammo. Yep. Uh, we already have plenty. For now. Okay, let's carry on. here where's the nearest oasis oh, okay we can just grab water from the prison itself confirm So right now everybody should be back to more or less alive. Yeah, I, I, I can hear the pigs winking. Yep. Celia, not Claudia. Maybe you should evacuate? Fast. Uh, which way? the level changer come on now I think it's easier if I just go up here also there is another thing that I want to do on the way. Did 
do we already hack these? Oh, we already hacked these. Okay, so basically, this lets us know that red ain't here anymore. So, where is it on the map? Okay, it is here. Ah, no, it's okay, it's out of the frame. Now I get it. Yes. assumption that the uh, shit is pretty much the same so far. Ooh. Like I I kind of accept the idea that there probably isn't a very good solution here but just like with the nuke I think that there might be like a somewhat more optimal solution that is slightly less shitty maybe I don't know okay you guys stay here That's the thing. The robot is operational. But it's not it's not moving, so that sort of telegraphs the idea that we actually can't do anything. <laughs> Strongly worded warning. <laughs> Can you talk some sense into it? Can you use repair on it? No. Back again, Rangers. Come a little closer. I can't hear you.
don't think he oh, hears us. Shit. <laughs> what if we had a dog with us? These turrets are like, are the shit. And I'm guessing there's no way to sneak like to the side either. I have already tried many times. Not even here. Okay, you take Team Robot back to the others. improve health. <laughs> uh, I think that uh, the turret thing is still like insta kill. not even toaster repair I think here seems to indicate that that we can't do anything here I mean if we were really, really, really good. Oh, that's, I know that cave. That's, that's that cave. But let's examine. Maybe there's like an extra passage there that we haven't uh, noticed so far. Because like this, this cliff face connects to the prison. What if there's like an extra passage there? Nothing under here, I suppose. Oh, <laughs> bodies. that we we have already uh, studied this but what if we miss something okay we need to face north so facing north prison is that way Ish. Okay, we have the wizard figurine there. Uh, 
switches or anything. There's a safe empty. Okay. Hmm. This will lead us back to the valley. Well, fuck. Another idea is what if we brought a dog with us? from high pool I think I think I'm gonna experiment some before I commit to any given solution and this this goes for the radio doodad as well because putting the repeater up will kick the prison stuff in the gear and if there is something we can actually do in this current state, then I want to know about it. But, right now I need to go to bed. So this episode ends here, with an epic cactus. I will see you in another time. Bye bye!